Hey everyone, it's Baby Bear and coming at you with this fountain update. Now, do you remember the other day I did a video where there was a glitch where people were able to get more points than they were supposed to? And basically, Ebony reset them all back to 450 because they wanted people to spend on this fountain wheel event. So as you can see here, you're going to see very familiar names. I heard this T same guy is actually going to 43 during this event. Uh, Vinny always spending. Sir Philip is there. So you see people trying to stack this fountain because the fountain gives you March capacity boost. Now, is it worth it? Is it worth this wheel? You're going to find out. So I, again, took one for the team, just got one pack just so you guys can see the situation with it. But there was already a glitch in the matrix. So you will see that as well. Um, I'm just scrolling down here because I want you guys to see that Sapphire on her free spin. She got one for free and I did as well, but I didn't get the fountain. So luckily I videoed it and go into customer service and I better get my fountain back. Um, they did respond to my email about Sappho. So you'll see that as well. And as you see here, it just keeps spinning. And I know it's not updated, but that really shouldn't matter, right? I mean, as long as it lands on an item, that's all that matters. So it could be because it wasn't updated. However, it did land on the on the fountain. And I'm almost wondering, did you all land on the fountain on the first spin? Because maybe that's just like them getting people sucked in to keep buying packs so they keep getting more because you do have to stack those fountains in order for you to actually get a good march capacity so at this point i'm just not even surprised anymore that something doesn't work and i feel like maybe ebony just really hates me and they already programmed my keep to like just always have these glitches and stuff like I don't understand it, but it always happens. But I don't understand why, because then I'm going to then go to you guys and show you that something doesn't work. Like, the, if anything, they should program my keep to be wonderfully perfect so that I'm never complaining about anything. So it just so happens that, of course, this happened on my account and I'm the one that puts it out there so you guys can see it. Um, and uh, apparently when you win the fountain, it just goes into your ideal land inventory so it doesn't go into your items you know in your item sack it goes into the actual ideal land so that's where I went don't look at this design guys it's ugly I have been trying to work on it but I haven't had time but there's the fountain right there that you're supposed to get which I don't have so so yeah just typical um now I can just show you here nothing nothing it's it's nowhere to be found so luckily uh sapphire received it so at least i wasn't going in blind thinking that you know i'm looking everywhere and just i didn't put it in this video but i was looking everywhere i was going through all of my items for like 10 minutes <laughs> and and didn't find it but you know sapphire is like no it's in this inventory in the ideal land place so um, yeah, I just, again, again, just, you know, try it with caution, proceed with caution. Obviously, the one reason why people are going to want this fountain is because you want to upgrade your ideal land to level two to get the construction boost, right? So I, I get why people are doing the spinning thing. Um, however, a lot of people are, uh, spending a lot of money on it. But when you actually look at the March capacity boost, it's it's not that much. So, so I'm not really sure, uh, you know, why they why they want to spend so much on it. Um. Also, just you can go look at other people's lands. I showed you guys that in another video, but I really like that because you're able to kind of see what boost people have. Um, but you'll see that fountain there that Sapphire placed. So here is the conversation about Sappho. And they basically said that she's not available because she's temporarily opened in a test section. So, <laughs> yeah, like, I don't know. They just, like, got rid of her. Who knows? 
Um, and so here is me trying to create a ticket about the spin wheel and just, you know, you know they're not going to answer it within 24 hours. Who knows? Maybe if they actually have an answer, maybe they'll give me the item without any gripe. Um, because I did even put there that I also have a video of it. So I feel like the more you prove, like I feel like if you ever do spin wheels or things that you need to prove, I feel like they act quicker when they know you have concrete evidence because if they don't respond to something where you can really show people concrete evidence on it, um, they they don't want to they don't want to deal with that. So even though it's a pain, my advice on the spin wheels is just to record it just in case. And here is a $9.99 pack and with a double coupon and you'll see that, of course, I'm not going to get lucky on, on the ones that I actually purchased. So I just wanted you guys to see what the pack entails, what it is, so you can make your own educated decision if you want to follow through on this wheel. And of course, if you end up spending, you can use my Aptoid code in the description. And I'm hoping you guys all get the fountain on the free spin. So wishing you luck and see you on the next one.